Morgan. Obviously, the first half offensively just kind of looked out of sorts. You know, there was some confusion. Just, I mean, but to only be down by three at halftime, just what kind of changed in the second half offensively? Because you guys were able to obviously look a lot more in rhythm, a lot better flow. Yeah. Just kind of what changed after that tough first half? Um, just the first half, it was very choppy. Like uh, we didn't have a flow on, like what you were saying, a flow on offense. And we talked a lot about having a flow on offense because we get good shots when that happens. So when our offense is stagnant, um, kind of just regrouping and, and understanding like the movement off the ball. Because on the balls, when we set ball screens and stuff, that's fine. Um, they were trying to ice the ball screen, so we kind of had to make an adjustment to that. Um, but after we made that adjustment, I think we did fine. How much of it is still obviously trying to adjust to losing Lexi, obviously? tough injury, you know, these last couple games, is it still kind of learning to play with some, some new players? Also? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, like you saw Kieran and Taya step up really big. Um, we've made an emphasis on them about how much impact they can make on the game, and you saw that today. Um, obviously, Lex was a big piece and a big uh, leadership part, so uh, me and Amy have definitely tried to step up our, um, you know, conversations with the team and stuff like that while she's gone. Um, but yeah, it's a big hole to fill, but um, we've really tried to do it and uh, had the next man up. Speaking of the freshmen, I mean, to play three freshmen in these two games and Matt Kane, you know, in clutch moments and tight yeah. contests, and for them to perform the way they have, what does it say just about kind of how they've embraced their roles and just kind of their, their presence to be trusted in moments like that? Yeah, you know, Paige, I mean, Paige has been starting since the start of the season, so she has a ton of confidence already. But getting Kieran and Taya in there is just a confidence booster because they can do it. But then them doing it every possession is, like, the next step because we've seen spurts of them, you know, at their best. Um, and we've given them confidence and practice to, you know, understand what they're capable of for sure. But it's just huge for our team because um, it just adds depth. Just the post presence tonight was was huge for the second half. I mean, your quarter twelve points and, and really aggressive in the paint yeah. in that third quarter there. I mean, Taya's getting tons of defensive rebounds, tons of blocks. Yeah. I mean, Kieran's guarding their best player, obviously. Right. I mean, just how important? I mean, obviously the guards are talented on this team, but yeah. how important is is that post presence to be able to have a game like this and to be able to count? Yeah. Just adding length to our team, because our guards are, are kind of small, you know. So adding length, um, and then it was a mismatch down there. I mean, Erica went to work, and she can do that every game. She, we just need to feed her the ball, and she needs to have the confidence in herself. But I think this game really is, is going to help us for the rest of Mac, just understanding what we're capable of and the certain lineups that we uh, succeeded in. You guys are now 5-0 in games decided by single digits. <laughs> Is it nerve? I mean, is it nerve-wracking playing in so many games like this, or do you guys really try to embrace the fact that you are in a position where you know, you know how to close out the win? Yeah, I mean, I think Coach Fred really has a lot of faith in us, and we have a lot of faith in him. I mean, he's cool, calm, and collective the whole time, and I think that helps us not be so jittery. Yeah, that was obviously um, uh, really special. And then to get a practice has prepared us. You know, we do score, stop, score, and pressure, night. free throws. Um, we do all that in yeah, practice. It was, it was really so when it comes to a game, really cool it's it's just like another day, you know. Yeah, I think uh, I think personally, I just want to do the best I can and do it. Um, use my skills to help the team, and uh, whether yeah, that be I mean, I think we were hitting E and, ice, um, and really finding her, and I think that that really gave her momentum to just keep going harder, and, and it gave us um, like the guards a little pressure off, so we could have more driving lanes and uh, a little more open shots. But you know, when we get it on a roll. Uh, um, yeah, I think that's a good question. Quickly, I, I so. think the biggest thing for young athletes is just to be consistent with your work. Um, obviously, um, develop a passion for hockey and just yeah, continue working on your skills. Yeah, she's been big for us. Um, um, little things I think this on and game and, ice, um, and last game she's day, really shown that she can rebound the ball and defend, and, and that's really what we need her to do. She can make little plays, little buckets for us, but her length really disrupts a lot of teams for sure. Oh, it, so like when E um, yeah, blocked think, uh, on the, the sideline and then Tay did the same thing. I mean, that just that just um, gets us going. That just makes us want to get a stop you know, get, for sure. Get some guys back. Um, but yeah, I think we've done a really good job this week, kind of preparing, um, working on our systems, working on some things we wanted to clean up, and working really hard. I think the guys have done a really good job of that, and I think we're really excited for Friday. Just kind of rally around, you know, losing, kind of losing a big player like that. Yeah, I mean, Coach Fred just talks about filling the gap. I mean, like we got to fill it somehow, some way. Next person up, you know. Um, not trying to make, not one person's going to score those 20 points. You know, we have to do it on the defensive end and stop teams, and then we'll figure it out on offense for sure.